What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash this up button to be notified for future readings. This is free general collective reading for all signs. Cap through side to everybody in between. Depth to basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate. Leave the rest. Free general collective reading. 7.30 a.m. 1-7-2023. I hope everybody's doing well. I do, I do, I do. Okay, so I received another one that's not good. So if it triggers you, click off. Just saying, just saying. Okay, so, um, well, I can't say it's not good. I mean, I guess one of them could be good. I'm just saying one could be good. One could be. Um, it's younger Aquarius masculine energy. So I feel these younger Aquarius masculines, there's at least two in the universe. I feel they could be 35, 34 below. We'll have Aquarius in any aspects of their charts. Um, okay. So, I heard the younger Aquarius masculines are about to find out that um, someone they have recent, one is their partner, one is their partner, um, that the partner's pregnant, again, I heard again, so I don't know if they have, you know, one child or ten children, but about to find out their partner's pregnant again. So, one, they're in a, I'm assuming a healthy relationship, but it may not be, but they're definitely with somebody, um, like committed, I'm presuming. But one of these situations is, as um, I heard it was long distances. It was long distances, and I heard this younger Aquarius masculine does not know the person is pregnant. And I um, I heard they're about to find out they're pregnant. And I heard in one of these situations, it is triplets. Triplets! Three kids! So I don't know if that's the committed partner or the one that lives far distances. There's at least two in here. Where they're about to find out they're either a committed partner or it sounds like a fling or a one night stand or hit it and quit it or whatever, 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 um, is pregnant. But somebody's pregnant with triplets in this bitch. Triplets. Three. Three fetuses in the womb. Whether it's the committed partner or the one far distances. Younger Aquarius masculines about to find this out. They can have Aquarius in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, or them in Hamish of your charts. But somebody's pregnant with triplets in this biatch. Three fetuses. Nay, nay. Nay, fucking nay. Not for me, may nay. Just saying, just saying. Woo! One of these people is in a false marriage and it's about to blow the hell up. And go very badly for them. Oh my god. And one of these people's in a false marriage. And it's about to blow the hell up. And go very badly for them. So one of these people put somebody in a false marriage. Or collaborated with somebody. Put somebody in a false marriage. Now how the hell you put somebody in a false marriage. And you don't go through the legal system. To do it in a fraudulent forgery. Illegal kind of way. I don't know. But it sounds like they're knocking somebody else up that's not their fucking spouse. So I hope the real spouse finds out and files in, uh, well, they can't file a divorce on them, but a lawsuit on their ass. Because obviously, they're screwing other people. And that's just the truth. And the only reason you put somebody in a false marriage is for money. So, I mean, but I heard it's about to blow up on them. It's about to backfire on them in a huge way. Okay, I heard it's about to backfire on them in a huge way. There's at least two of them. So I think only one has put somebody strategically into false marriage. Um, you plug it in how it resonates. But obviously they're out screwing other people. The one in the false marriage. And that's just the truth. Obviously it wasn't for love, caring, affection. It was to steal some shit for somebody. Way to go, con artist. Way to fucking go. Woo! The one that is about to find out about triplets, they're about to find it out soon. In an unexpected way. The one that, okay, so the one that has knocked somebody up and they're impregnated with triplets, three fetuses in the womb, they're about to find it out in an unexpected way soon. So soon, eight of wands with a five, five, five change energy, they're about to find it out soon, but in an unexpected way. I don't know. I don't know if it, I don't know if it's the one that's far distances or the one they're in a, 
I guess a committed relationship with, however that resonates, but um, they're about to find out in an unexpected way. That's why I love being hashtag legally single. And you don't have to worry about that bullshit. That's just the truth. You don't have to worry about people cheating on you or having little flings on business trips or pleasure trips or whatever. Um, people are so fucking whack these days. And that's just a freaking truth. Dang. And there's about to be a significant child custody battle in one of these situations. And a child will be, there will be a custody change and a child will be moved, removed from a home. Oh my God. And in one of these situations, I heard there's going to be a significant child custody battle in one of these situations. I don't know if the child custody battles already began or it's about to, but. Heard in one of these situations, a child will be removed from the home. I don't know if it's an Aquarius's home or the secret, the secret baby mama that's pregnant for distances or the one they're in a committed relationship with or somebody else's child custody battle. But somehow a child custody battle is significant to one of these younger Aquarius masculines and somehow is not going to go in somebody's favor and a child's about to be removed from a home. In some, in one situation, it's two, two plus children, at least, okay, two custody battles. In one situation, it's going to be two, two plus children, and one's going to be one, uh, child custody battle energy. Child abuse, child abuse, child abuse. So it sounds like they're about to be removed from the home, or the switch in child custody will be because of child abuse. Now, child abuse, if it's child abuse, I'm presuming the other person's rights, parental rights, are going to be taken away. I'm presuming. I'm not a lawyer, but or a judge, or I don't work in legal sector. But that's what I'm presuming, because if you get proven and accused of child, I mean, if child abuse can be proven, and you're in the middle of a child custody battle, rights should be stripped from one, is what I'm trying to say. But there's at least two child custody battles, it sounds like, already happening, or is about to happen, and a child's going to be removed from or children is going to be removed from home. Somehow, the younger Aquarius masculines are connected to this in some shape, form, or fashion. Um, I just want to PSA this real quick for people. Don't be going around impregnating your sperm or using your eggs or whatever, 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 whether you're a man or woman, eggs or sperm, and producing children if you don't, one, can't financially take care of them, and two, if you don't want to financially take care of them, and three, if you plan on uh, not taking care of them. Everybody needs to hear that. You should have kids to grow and nurture and love them. This is coming from a single mother that's raised kids almost a decade by herself. Everybody needs to hear that. All right, love you. Namaste.